Hey guys, how you doing? Dave here. Today we're making up these cute little uh, chocolate sugar cookies. They're chocolatey, they're crunchy, they're just simply wonderful. I think you're going to like them and watch the whole video because at the end of the video we're going to announce the, the winner of our Chef Cosmo baking mat. So I think you're going to like this. So let me walk you through it. So we're going to begin here with a stick of butter which is about 113 grams. And I'll do the whole conversion thing in the captions below. With two thirds of a cup of white granulated sugar. Grab up the electric mixer here and we're just going to cream this until it's nicely combined. Now we're going to add in a tablespoon of oil. And you can use any kind of oil. I'm using vegetable oil here. An egg. And a few drops of vanilla extract. This is totally optional, but I just like the taste. And once again, grab up the electric mixer and give it a mix. I should mention you can do this with a whisk as well. I just killed the electric mixer because you can't hear me over it. Until it comes together, something like this. This is just about perfect. After that, you're going to sift in a cup and a half of all-purpose flour. A quarter cup of cornstarch half a cup of unsweetened cocoa and about half a teaspoon or a pinch of salt just to bring out those flavors. I'll just go ahead and sift this in. A sifting we will go. Again grab up the mixer or a whisk and we're just going to mix this until it comes together. Until it comes together something like this and this is to me a pretty good cookie dough and if you find it a bit too sloppy, you can always add a bit more flour. But this is about a cup and a half, and I think this is perfect. All right, what we're going to do now is go ahead and spatula this onto some cling wrap. Wrap it up, and we're going to let this set in the fridge just to rest for about half an hour. Mmm, I can smell it. It smells yummy already. Now our cookie dough is nicely chilled. I'm just going to unwrap it here and lay it on a piece of parchment paper. Lay another piece over the top. This just saves a whole lot of hassle of, you know, sticking to the roller and stuff like that. And just kind of roll it out. So we've rolled this out to about, I say an eighth to a quarter inch thick. So I'm just gonna lift the parchment paper off the top and take my handy dandy cookie cutter. You know, you can use anything you want, shape of a heart, but this is kind of a one I like. And I'm just going to kind of press it in and make as many cookies out of this as I possibly can. And you want to get as close as you can to the, you know, to the other cookies. So I'm just going to remove the excess here and we can kind of, you know, re-roll the the dough we have. Now I'm just going to grab up our cookies and set them aside on my handy dandy Chef Cosmo baking mat which we're going to announce the winner of. Now we're going to slip this into a 375 degree Fahrenheit 190 Celsius for a few minutes just to bake. After about eight minutes, there you have it guys, our chocolate sugar cookies. So we're just going to grab them up and put them on a wire rack to cool. Okay, let's give these a taste. They're so cute, aren't they? Mmm. These are really good, guys. They've got a bit of a crunch. They're chocolatey. All the flavors come together so nicely. So great with a cup of tea or a glass of milk. Definitely a must try. You're gonna love these. And the winner of the draw is Bridget Umphreys. Bridget is a great lady, always commenting on videos and stuff like that. So Bridget will be in contact with you. 
for the full scoop on this recipe and many more great recipes, head on over to cookandshare.com. All kinds of great stuff over there. Give us a thumbs up and most of all, subscribe. Thanks for watching and catch you next time.